the intellectual is uh, concerned. Your Excellency, our special guest of honor, one of the reasons why I invited you, you are supposed to commission the rumor pre flyover. I changed my mind that you should come and commission this Mbolo We where people say Ikoku. And I am sure you know most of the traders, like you say you're a trader, most of your colleagues, traders, according to you, I'm not the one who said it. You say you're a trader. So most of your colleagues, traders, are here. They are here. So I said it would be better for your colleagues to receive you. And so that's why you are seeing all the traders here today, selling uh, all spare parts and the rest of the thing. But the most important thing, when I started this flyover, there was a lot of blackmail campaign that I'm chasing the Igbos away. I'm sure you must have heard of it. Isn't there themselves who are here? Who are saying, oh, be careful, oh, be careful, oh, be What do most of them? There was nothing they did not say. Here was as bad as anything. This is a law of us in your road. But I said, look, business can only thrive in a very good environment. Today, all of them now appreciate why we have to do this road before it will be traffic all the way. We will travel from here to Azikwe Junction if we have the strength. We will travel from here. That's part of the exam you will pass today, whether you, can, you have the strength to track. So we will track and you see what we have done. People don't like good things. Before traders will take over the road, you will see forknizers, everybody. But I think everybody is happy. And to say that this road concern has nothing to do with any ethnic group, rather to enhance and improve economic uh, activities. And Nigeria should stop. Anyone to do anything who will begin to bring ethnicity, who will begin to bring religion. Jonathan, go to the hotel presidential area. We built the quarters of the Nadan Law School where the, the lecturers will stay. And then by the side of you, you see all these people, money, what did they call them? Breed the change, not even that, I don't call them breed the change. See them hanging around everywhere. And we have presidential hotel. And I called them, I said, listen, this area does not require this. People can stand there thinking they are, they are money changers or whatever. You wouldn't know that they are criminals. Go and get a place where you will be doing your money exchange or whatever. Do you know what happened? Before I know it, they said, oh, I'm chasing the houses away. I said, how? How will I do that? So every decision you take to improve in your environment, to improve economic activities, when it affects one or two persons from social area, they will go and say, oh, you are chasing us uh, away. When I chase you away, what will the economy of this state? It is my interest that people will do business here, economic activities will boom, internal generated revenue will come up, and we'll use the money to develop our state. And so people should always understand that in terms of 